my god wow hi guys welcome back to my channel i know i look a little crazy right now my brows are not finished my hair is crazy but i want to show you guys how i do this i'm going to be applying this pony which is they call it an insta pony and this was actually made by someone locally in the bahamas and she started doing this during quarantine and i'm going to apply this today on my hair show you guys how i do it as well as give you an updated low bun low ponytail tutorial as you know that's one of my top videos on this channel and i want you guys to know and see how i'm gonna do it now that my hair is longer it doesn't look longer but my shrinkage is about 80 percent so thanks for tuning in i'm happy you are here and let's get to it and don't mind my unfinished room but it is what it is baby and i'm watching green leaf so y'all have to see this considering and the fact the guy they're blaming is dead is heavy so yeah basically just start by parting your hair and the routine is basically the same um, from when I used to do my hair when it was much shorter I use a light spritz of water leave-in conditioner and then I just go in with gel I like Eco Styler the red top gel or I would use the black castor oil but I prefer the red argan oil the most for my hair type you coming in or not The routine is you do it in sections. The thicker your hair is, the smaller the section. The thinner your hair is, the less sections you need to do. For me, I do about four sections. Um, my advice is to actually loose that back back ponytail once you've already put it in one. Yeah, I mean, this is what you have wanted your whole life. Seems like you guys are doing okay. Does it? What do you want, Jacob? Look, I You're definitely trying to reduce bulkage while doing this style. So my suggestion would definitely be to detangle by hand first. Use your leave-in, gel, and brush. You detangle the brush, then your ball bristle brush to get a smooth finish. It seems it's been buried. But the new plan is ready to grow. As you can see, also, I'm going to now add some extra gel to the top and then I'm going to go at my nape and pretty much loosen up the back. Um, my suggestion is once you've done that first pony and you go in to do your second, loose the ponytail and then just add your second pony, second section. There's a trick that I like to use when I do my hair like this I like to use the main choice stubborn edges freezing gel it's because it's very sticky and it will keep the fireways away so I use about that amount sorry to bother you oh, sorry. and sorry. I put that to the top now we're gonna tie down our hair <laughs> Yeah. My hair, 
I was told that I don't have to put my hair in a pony or I don't have to clear out my ponytail. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna do like a banded. I'm gonna do like a banded pony. This is my little banded pony, and I am about to add my Insta pony from Lucy Lou. You can find her on Instagram. I'll make sure I put her Instagram on the screen and tag her below. But this is my pony. This is how it looks. So turn around. I hope I have a camera. And I'm gonna take it and put it the comb right there. Then I'm gonna take this piece, leave that to the front. Curve this like ooh, whoa. Okay. Curve this like this. Curve this like this. I'm about to do spray on it. I'm gonna spray some more. I'm gonna spray some more. You know. And I'm going to put my bobby pins here. I'm gonna hair pins. I don't have any shot. Okay. I'm gonna take a hairpin, not a bobby pin, as this will help to secure my pony. I know I don't have to, but you know, for safety purposes, it just makes sense. All right, so I want you guys to take a closer look. Closer look. Hopefully, it's cute. it's all covered but let me just shave my nape put I have a lot of cousins in the back there that needs to go jeez Louise I don't know I feel like I look cute but I don't know what my quality in my video looking like like I feel like my eyes look even more red on camera I don't know anyway this is the finished look. I know the shirt probably is too casual to go with the earrings, but bitch, we don't have to go with this. Um, technically, 
y'all i'm telling you this is how it looks it's actually very long it's very long very thick you can always get your ponytails customized with the amount of hair that you want in your pony don't be afraid to you know let her know exactly what it is that you want um i feel like this is perfect for persons with natural hair because doing that wrap around ponytail one you waste hair because now you have to kind of like glue the tracks up on it and then two this is actually sewn on it on the cap like material and not cap it's almost like a lace and it's actually very very good so if anyone is interested in this her details will be in my um comment section but not in the comments i'll post it in the comment section comment section as well as i'll put it in my description box her instagram is right there i'm pretty sure she'll be okay with shipping it to you if it gets to that point and if you really love it and interested and you want to pay that coin but personally i think it came out really good here's how it looks let me zoom it in just a little bit more so you can get a clear idea as to how All of the makeup that I have on, I will tag it in the description box as well. So thank you guys for watching this video and bye!